can be a pain You're not a man until you've come of age We've given up our teenage years And the effort to pursue our careers mm -hmm. Who resumes responsibility Our families Who's protecting us from harm? Is there anyone around That we can trust So we'll search for answers to our questions No answers But we're taught a lesson every time Through mistakes we've learned the wisdom, life's responsibilities falls in our hands, and learning, keep on growing, wisdom helps us understand, we're maturing, with So what's up? It is your boy, Mr. House of Jazz. Woo. And it is so great to be back in my little music area, my little studio, as you might want to call it, and not sitting in the hospital bed for two weeks. Uh, if you want to know what happened, I have like two or three videos, very short videos explaining what happened. I was not supposed to be in the hospital that long, but the hospital messed me over. But anyway, that's not why we're here right now. Right now, we are here for another tutorial. And uh, just before I got sick and had to go into the hospital, uh, this song was requested. Uh, this song, uh, which is Boys to Men by New Edition. So we're not talking about the group Boys to Men. We're talking about the song Boys to Men by New Edition, which the group no boys the men actually named themselves after this song so you know according according to what they say you know people say a lot of stuff in interviews that's not necessarily true but that's what boys the men say the song came on the radio and was like yeah this called ourselves boys the men but anyway um i cannot remember the name of the person offhand but he also requested you're not my kind of girl so by the time I do the tutorial for You're Not My Kind of Girl, I'm going to have his name ready so that I can give him props because he did send him money for the two songs. Um, so this one is Boys to Men. And again, when I do the You're Not My Kind of Girl tutorial, which should be the next one that I do, and I might be able to do that one today too, um, I will make sure that I I'll give him props on that video. And in the video description of this one, I would definitely have his name in there. So um, without further ado, um, let's get to the song. It's actually basically the same chords throughout the whole thing with different little, um, I guess you can say little passing chords here and there. So it's not really hard. This is a pretty simple song. So you start with your first chord, which is technically, it's a G flat six nine chord as they will call it because you're playing the sixth and the ninth, but let me just spell it out for you. On your left hand, G flat, S, D flat, sorry, and G flat, right? So G flat, D flat, and G flat again. On the right hand, you wanna play A flat, B flat, D flat, and E flat. So basically you're playing all five of these black keys right here. All five of those black keys. The way I'm doing it is I'm doing four of the black keys with my right hand. And my left hand is playing that black key and, of course, the D flat. So all black keys, right? That, if that helps. <laughs> so we got, um, before I even, before I do that, the song technically starts with you going. 
Mm-hmm. You have to do that first. I'm sorry. So you have A flat, A flat. So when you hear the track, you'll hear it. It goes. Growing up can be a. So that's your first chord, and then your second chord is just an F minor seven. One three five. Sometimes I add that fourth too. You can add that fourth to add a nice richer sound. You don't have to put the B flat in there. But anyway, on the right left hand, I'm sorry. F C F. On the right hand, you can just play an A flat chord, A flat major chord, and really you can add that B flat cuz it does add a, a nice little, you know, fuller sound. So that's without the B flat with it. Without it with it. It's up to you, you know what I'm saying? So you're going to go between those two chords for a while. Growing up can be a pain. You're not a man until you come of age. Now they throw this chord in there. This is one of those little passing chords they put in there. This is just a B flat minor. Um, I'm playing the A flat, so it's a minor 7. B flat minor 7, that's all it is. So on the left hand, you can just play a B flat. And on the right hand, you can play F, A flat, B flat, D flat. And you just throw it in there real quick. And then go right back to those two chords again, the G flat chord and the F minor 7 chord. Growing up can be a pain. You're not a man until you've got other age. Flat minor. We giving up our teenage years. Now you come out of that chord cycle and you want to go to an E flat major chord and the effort to per and that like again that's just an E flat chord. On your left hand, E flat, B flat, E flat. Right hand is an E flat major chord. G B flat E flat. And the effort to pursue. Keep the E flat chord on your right hand, and you can just move off the E flat on the left hand and put your E flat over G. That's all it is. So I'm playing the same chord. And the effort to pursue. See what I did? All I did was just, I, I left the E flat and the B flat and just went to G and just put G in the bass. And the effort to pursue. Okay. I'll career. Now this chord is um, A flat on the left hand. That's your bass. And I'm playing just a regular G flat chord. Um, you probably can play, I wouldn't play it that way, yeah. I, I will play it either just G flat, B flat, and D flat. And if you really want to, you probably can add this A flat. Since you're playing A flat in the bass anyways, you know, so you can add that A flat. You know, so in the effort to pursue our careers, and then you go back to that E flat over G before you start playing the verse, you know, those same chords again. So, again, this is E flat over G again, G on the left hand, G, B flat, and E flat. Okay, so you got and the effort to pursue our careers. Is, sorry about that. Is, my finger slipped right there. Let me do that again. I'm sorry. And the effort to pursue our careers. Is, you see what I did? Then you just go right back to those same cycle of chords again. You got the G flat chord where you're playing all the black keys. Who resumes responsibility? F minor 7 again. Of having to support our family. Throw the B flat. Remember that B flat minor 7. Then who can tell us that we're wrong? Then go to the E flat again. Is there anyone? And then put it over G. That we can trust. So we. So you know what I'm saying? So you're still doing the same chord cycles. So we search for answers to our questions. You're still playing the same chords. First could be taught a lesson. The F minor seven. And 
I think you, you can play that again. Be mistakes return, gather wisdom. Then E flat. Now, when you're getting ready to go into the chorus, and wisdom, wisdom helps us see our responsibility. This time, you don't go back to the to that chord like you do when you're going to the chorus. You play this chord again, the A flat over G flat, and then you just move up to A flat major on your right hand. Life's responsibility falls in our hands. And Learning. So all I did right there is when you come from this chord and then G flat over A flat and all you do is before you go to the chorus, just play a regular A flat chord. Just keep the A flat on the right hand. Feel free to add the E flat if you want to make it stronger, fuller. And then A flat, C, E flat. Again, you only play this when you're getting ready to go to the chorus. All the other times you go back to the E flat over G and you start playing those two chords again. But when you're going into the chorus, life's responsibility falls in our hands. A hand. You know what I'm saying? Okay, now you're going into the chorus. Now with the chorus... I believe that they are still playing the same G flat chord. They're playing the exact same G flat chord that they're doing for the verses. So it's the same chord. But what I'm what I did was I just added the F, which is like what the 13th of the scale. So I guess you can call it like a G flat 6, 9, 13, something crazy. But I just do that just because it just makes it, it, it just brightens the chord up just a little bit for the chorus. So you got life's responsibility falls in our hand, hand on learning. So all I did was just, so I'm playing the same chord from the verse, but I just added an F. So let me just spell it out again. So it's G flat, D flat, G flat on the left hand. On the right hand, I'm still playing all your black notes. A flat, B flat, D flat, E flat. And I just added the F again just to bright, brighten it up. On the track, I think J Jimmy Jam is still just... I think he's still playing that, but you can brighten it. It just sounds pretty. And if you really want to brighten it up, you can really spread it out. Now again, this is not on the track. This is just if you want to jazz it up and make it sound pretty. I'm just showing you other ways of doing it. So when the chorus comes in, you can either just add the F, or if you want to play it this way, keep on learning. So if you want to do this alt alt alternate chord, I guess you could say, you still got G flat, D flat, and G flat on the left hand. But your other option is on the right hand, you're basically playing a B flat minor seven spread out in its root position. B flat, D flat, F, A flat. I'm learning. So again, you can keep playing this, this. You can play it the way I think the album does it. Just the same chords, or you can just add an F. Learning, or you can really jazz it up and go. Learning. But I will go back. To, I, I still will go back to the F minor seven chord right there. Because if you, to me, that's if you try to play the F minor. What's that? One, three, five, seven, nine. We, if you try to play an F minor nine, it sounds like it. It almost like takes away from the song at that point. So I wouldn't do it right there. But I sure enough learning without knowing. If you want to do the F minor nine because you just want to make the song sound different, fine. But my suggestion would be go right back to this chord, which is what we've been playing the whole time. You know what I'm saying? Just those same two chords, okay? So whichever one you choose, okay, I spent more than time than I wanted to on that. So okay. Learning. 
you're still going through those two chords again. Wisdom helps us understand. So you're still doing G flat, your G flat chord, and then your F minor seven chord, and then you go to E flat. These are the things, E flat over G, that change boys to men. Oh, the goals we set. See what I just did? It's the same chords. It's the same chords. So you're still going back and forth between the G flat chord and your F minor 7 chord. Whichever G flat chord you do, I showed you three different ones you can use. That I, To my ear, it sounds like, you know, it sounds pretty okay. So that's the whole song. That's it. Those are all the chords to the song. You're basically just bouncing off these two chords. Just those two chords. And when you come to the end of the cycle, you go to E flat. E flat over G and then A flat over G flat. Um, when you're in the middle of the verse, you can you can throw a B flat minor chord in the middle. And then when you um, you have to listen to the track to know when to do E flat over G and when to do this one. You have to just know the song. You have to know it. But I can show it to you. Let me just go through the first verse and chorus one more time. And I'm going to call this video complete because I showed you every chord you needed for the song. So going through the verse again, um, you can do the intro. Growing up can be a pain. So you got your two chords right there. You're not a man until you've come away. B flat, right? Sorry. Be giving up our teenage years. Then go to your E flat and the effort to over G our careers. Then walk back, go back to the E flat over G and go. Who resumes responsibility? Having to support our families. That's when you go to the B flat. Who can tell us that we're wrong? In E flat, is anyone out over G that we can't trust? So we search for answers to our questions. Still going through those two chords. I'll be taught a lesson every time. We mistakes we've learned, gather wisdom. Responsibility falls in our You go to the A flat Keep on learning And then you can use your alternative chords right there Alternate Wisdom helps us understand Keep on learning And then go to your E flat We go E flat over G. The goals we set may exceed reality. That's it. That's it, y'all. That's it. Um, I'm so glad that I was asked to do this tutorial because I was like, whenever I'm asked to do a tutorial, usually I'll say, I'll go check and say, well, let me see if somebody's done one already. And I was like, with this one, no one's done this song. I don't know why, because Johnny Gill killed this song. You know what I'm saying? He, he sung the mess out of this song and we have a group called boys the men that named themselves after this song so this song got some classic history behind it but you know so i'm honored that at least from what i know i'm the first one to do a tutorial on this song so that's pretty good that's pretty good so um any questions or anything you know if something was unclear feel free to ask any questions but that's all the chords you need you just sing the song and at the end they just do the chorus over and over again so you just play your little fancy chords, the, however you want to play the chords, I already showed you. So um, remember, um, if you have any requests and you would like to uh, use PayPal to give, you know, a donation for your request, just use my email address. It'll be in the description. Um, and I did set up a Patreon account. I'll put the information in the description also. For those that might want to just give a monthly donation, 
as low as one dollar. You know what I'm saying? As low as one. Right now, no one has signed up for it yet. But um, like I said, you know, you bless and you like you want to be a blessing to me because I've been a blessing to you. And like I said, people who are part of the Patreon, um, their uh, requests can get um, will be pushed up to the top to, uh, you know, song requests and stuff like that. Uh, you know, so it all, it's like first come, first, you know, first come, first serve type thing. The people that's been doing the PayPal thing, I mean, I've been super blessed by that too. So I just thank everyone. And for all the get well wishes when I was in the hospital, man, that was, it, it, it was, it, it was some serious stuff going on and wasn't sure, you know, if I was going to heal, right? I'm still in the process of healing right now, but, um getting my energy back and everything, but um, it looks like it's going to be a 100% recovery. So um, thank you all for your blessing, um, your prayers, and just your well wishes. All right, y'all. I'll catch you on the next one because I got to get some more of these tutorials done for this week. All right, y'all. Peace.